Hey, Bart Miller here with Cycling Strong. I want to talk about the Leadville 100 Mountain Bike Survival Guide that I put together for you. The reason I did this was when I decided to do Leadville 100 Mountain Bike Race, I knew it was going to be hard, and it was. Hardest race I've ever done. But there's a couple things I really didn't know a lot about. First of all, I really wanted to learn more about elevation and how it would affect my body, and if I should have a tent or if I shouldn't have a tent, or how to prepare for that. I also wanted to learn a lot more about nutrition, to be really fast in my transitions and to be able to get from A to B as quick as possible. Also, clothing and gear, such a big thing because the weather, being in the mountains like that, can change just like that. So I wanted to make sure I had the right stuff to accomplish the race. So I started looking for blogs, I started looking at all this kind of stuff. I was spending hours trying to find this kind of stuff and this information that I needed to survive the Leadville 100. I even went to the Leadville 100 mountain bike camp, which helped me a ton to be able to learn a lot of stuff prior to the race. I've gathered all that information, everything I've learned, I've put it in this book for you to be able to help you survive the Leadville 100 and make it a lot of fun for you. At the same time, be able to enjoy the race along the way. There's lots of tricks, there's lots of tips in this book, and I hope you really enjoy it. I can't wait to see you at the Leadville 100 finish line with me this year. We'll be able to ride it together. You'll see that I'm doing the exact same things I talk about this year as I talked about last year in the Leadville 100 Mountain Bike Survival Guide. So enjoy it. Let me know your thoughts. Make sure you subscribe to our channel on YouTube. Be part of our community. I do lots of fun stuff on the Leadville 100.